challenges. <gasps> They're the serious versions of us. Just what we need to kick us up a notch. Let's prove we're the best Titans in the multiverse. I think I know who's behind this. Oh, wow, yay, we're all besties now. Hi, this is Mark Morell from Toon Barn. We're here at the 50th anniversary of San Diego Comic-Con talking about a very special movie, Teen Titans Go versus Teen Titans. The world premiere is here next, yes. but it'll be available on Blu-ray, on October 15th and on digital on September 24th. And I'm here with the writers, Jeremy Adams and Marley Halpern Grazer. Good to be here. Yeah, it's always good to be in the barn. Yes. <laughs> so I want to know, were you guys fans of both of these shows, Teen Titans and Teen Titans Go? Yes, I was a fan of Teen Titans for sure. And then I got all angry when they canceled it. And now I know those people, so I can't be too angry. Yeah. And then they made Teen Titans Go, and there's always that initial reaction. It's sort of like Batman Brave and Bull. You're like, what are you doing to my characters? And then you see it, and you're like, oh, this is really good. And this is a totally different thing. And uh, yeah, so. Yeah, I was also a fan of the original Teen Titans. I feel like it's funny. Everyone now thinks of Teen Titans, the original Titans, as this like super serious, dark, brooding show, just because it is compared to Teen Titans yeah, Go. Yeah. But like, as a fan of these DC cartoons at the time, I remember when Teen Titans came out. I was like a surly teenager. I was looking at Teen Titans, going like, "This isn't Batman the Animated Series. Right. This is for kids." And then you know, I actually watched it and realized it was an amazing show with a great blend of action and humor. Uh, and I would say that Teen Titans Go is really the same thing, just pushed to another level, where it's just even more cartoony. It's even more heightened, but like all the stuff that makes the Teen Titans great is in both shows, and so yeah, I'm a, I'm a big fan of both properties. Okay. So the Teen Titans Go don't have a very good history with Santa Claus, do they? <laughs> oh, oh, let let Marley talk about this. this is Marley's brainchild, okay. you know? Uh, well, yeah. So when uh, when they asked me when they asked us to do the movie, one of the things that I did is I made a list of stuff from original Titans that would be fun to reference and stuff from Teen Titans Go that would be fun to reference and I was specifically looking for things that were really different. Stuff that like this could only be in Go, this could only be in original uh, and the biggest thing just blaring out on the Go list was the fact that the Teen Titans in Teen Titans Go have a reoccurring rival rivalry with Santa Claus which is an insane thing uh, and I thought that there was nothing there's no situation you could put the original Titans in that would make them more out of their element and more just generally unhappy to exist in the Go world than to have to go to the North Pole and fight Santa Claus. Oh, oh, oh. what took you so long? Santa Claus, he's right there. <laughs> Jeff and his team, it is beautiful. I mean, it really is beautiful. And uh, those guys are, I, it, it just makes, I, like every time I see artists do their thing, I'm just like, what am I doing? Like they are just genius wizards and I am just like scribbling words together, you know? Right. So they're really the, the unsung heroes here, you know? It's true. They should, you guys should be interviewing storyboard artists yeah, at these yeah, things. Yeah, yeah. They would have better answers. Oh they, my gosh. they actually did this They'd stuff. Like, these moron writers gave me this page and I thought, oh, I, I can't do that. So I'll do this better thing, you know? <laughs> Seriously. Well, I want to thank you guys for joining us at Toon Barn at the 50th anniversary of San Diego Comic-Con for Teen Titans Go versus Teen Titans. You got it. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. And for you guys, the filmmakers, um, you got to do that great sequence where you kind of jump through all of the genres of, uh, of the, the DC stuff. Anything that you had to kind of like get clearance for or something you're like, please don't do that one. The, well, there was a version with the cartoon tower where they actually went through the tower and you saw the tower kind of... <laughs> Oh, I yeah. to, and and we, uh, yeah, we went back on that one, but um, no, DC was very supportive as they always are and flexible with what they let us do, and I, we really got to have our cake needed too with all those different sure. versions of the Titans. It was fun. No, that is true. That that's the section that I most feel like we really got away with something, and I'm really proud of every uh, world that they go through because when me and Jeff talked about it and wrote up the original script, I basically had a giant question mark next to every single one because I didn't like, literally on the script. On the script, I was like. They go to the tiny Titans world. <laughs> so maybe we go into the DVD world. Hopefully.
hopefully the Perez Wolfman Titans. I just really, I just kept expecting every single one to get taken away, and they're all in there. Yeah. Well, it's who did the baby, the little baby Titans? Who did those character designs? The, little, the super little baby ones? Oh, the the Titan Titans. That's a yeah, yeah, that's a real cartoon. I mean, the comic book. It's a what's it? Art Ball Titans. With the Beast Boy with the four teeth. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, they're great. Um, they're now, great. now that you've shown that you can bring the Titans into the DC animated stuff with Sean's character, any idea, or did you guys start bouncing the idea of doing a crossover there? I mean, who wants to see that? <laughs> Two years from now, we'll say, well, we were at the panel, and someone said, should we do this movie? And then that's where it all started. No use fighting, slighting, or nighting. All the same might, same might, great fighting. At the end of the day, we're